Hello everybody, going to do a review on the Brickmania Pacific Theater instruction book today. Here's the front cover. Here's the sticker sheet that it comes with. It's got a lot of stickers for minifigs, a few insignias, really cool little elephant there on the side. USMC stickers. Be interesting to see which kits these all go on. Here's a list of all the different uh, kits you can make out of this book. There are 11 of them. We have kits from Imperial Japan and the United States. Feel free to pause this video at any time to uh, read a little bit more on the different kits or just look at them. Here's an example of what the instruction book looks like. On the left you'll see a partial showing of the different parts needed for the Type 95 HIGO and on the left you'll see some of the initial build instructions for it. Pretty clear. Do a good job on them. On page one we find the Type 95 HIGO Japanese light tank. Looks pretty cool. Originally produced in 2016 Designer is Daniel Siskind. On page 11, we find the Type 97 Chaiha. I know I said that wrong. Japanese medium tank. It was originally released in 2015. Daniel Siskind also uh, was the designer of this kit. On page 21, we find the Type 1 47mm AT gun, Japanese anti tank artillery. Originally released in 2015. Another kit by Dan. Here is the Type 92 70 millimeter gun battalion artillery. Released in 2015. Dan is also the designer of this one. I'm seeing a theme here. Dan's got a lot of kits in this book. On page 29 we find the A6M0 Japanese long range fighter. Pretty cool kit. I think I've got one of the recent versions of this somewhere in a box here. This one was originally released in uh, 2016. It is on page 29. This one should be fun. It's the Iwo Jima Coastal Battery. Coastal Defense Fortification. It's got a little bunker and an anti-aircraft gun it looks like there. Originally released in 2016. This is a Kodeo cell design. Sorry you left the Brickmania. He will be missed. Anyway, this is on page 51. On page 71, we find the M2A4 Stewart, U.S. Marines light tank. Originally released in 2016. Another kit by Dan. Cool little tank. Here we have the M4A2 Sherman, U.S. Marines medium tank. Looks like it's got the snorkels on there so it can get out of the water. This kit was originally uh, released in 2016 by the designer Daniel Siskind. It is on page 85. Here we find ourselves on page 101 where we have the LVT-4 Amtrak landing vehicle. Nice amphibious vehicle. Originally released in 2016. Dan is also the designer of this one. Look at all those guns on there. Wow. Here we have the M1A1 75mm howitzer. Multi-purpose artillery. This was originally released in 2013. Dan was also the designer of this one. It can be found on page 125. Here we are on page 129 where we find the P-40 Warhawk Fighter Bomber. This kit was originally released in 2015. Designer is Dan also again. I believe they've done a reissue of this one here recently, maybe in the past year. Looks pretty cool. We find ourselves at the appendix. Here's the uh, tips and tricks, notes about Lego parts, aftermarket parts, talks a little bit about the Brickmania track links, which I hope they'll be releasing here soon. 
the Brick Arms U clip and the Brick Arms monopod. On the right side, you'll see a partial listing of the parts needed to build the Type 95 Hygo light tank. It shows you the quantity, part number, description, and color. You just take the part number and plug it into Bricklink or Brickal. Find the right color, and then you put in the quantity you want and build your list from there, and then buy all the parts that you need to make the kits. Here we find the back cover of the... Uh, instruction manual nice little picture there of a couple guys driving which I think is the amphibious tank earlier on it also uh, has a list of the different kits you can build which you saw I think in the earlier part of this uh, video if you like this video please like subscribe and share with your friends as always thank you for watching and have a good night